Michael Jackson, the King of Pop, A Life in Rhythm Michael Joseph Jackson, a name that resonates across generations, a voice that transcended boundaries and a figure who not only defined pop culture but transformed it. In 30 minutes, we will take a journey through the highs, the lows, and the unparalleled legacy of the man who became the King of Pop. Born on August 29, 1958, in Gary, Indiana, Michael's story began humbly. His talent, however, was anything but ordinary. Raised in a large family with eight siblings, Michael was thrust into the spotlight at a tender age as part of the Jackson Five. Under the strict and often harsh guidance of his father, Joe Jackson, Michael and his brothers, Tito, Jermaine, Jackie, and Marlon, formed one of Motown's biggest success stories in the late 1960s. Michael's unmistakable voice, dance moves, and charisma catapulted the Jackson 5 to international stardom. By age 11, Michael was already a household name. But despite the cheerful, polished performances, life behind the scenes was far from ideal. Joe Jackson's domineering style of management cast a shadow over Michael's childhood. But this pressure also sharpened him into a perfectionist, a trait that would define his career. In 1979, Michael's solo career took a meteoric turn with the release of Off the Wall, an album that blurred the lines between R&B, disco, and pop. Hits like Don't Stop Till You Get Enough and Rock With You showcased his ability to create infectious rhythm that pulled people onto the dance floor. But it wasn't just his music. It was the way Michael moved. His dance moves were electric, blending the fluidity of James Brown, the precision of Fred Astaire, and an ethereal touch that was all his own. The stage was his playground, and he dominated it with finesse and fearless creativity. Then came 1982, Thriller, an album that would not only redefine Michael Jackson's career, but revolutionized the music industry. The album sold over 100 million copies worldwide, becoming the best-selling album in history. From the haunting vibes of Thriller to the anthemic groove of Beat It, Every track was a masterpiece. It wasn't just the music, the accompanying visuals were groundbreaking. When Michael released the music video for Thriller, it wasn't just a music video. It was a short film, a cinematic experience that combined storytelling with music, dance, and groundbreaking special effects. Directed by John Landis, the video opened a new chapter in the way music videos were created. Artists no longer simply performed their songs, they told stories. The world witnessed something never seen before, the moonwalk. When Michael glided effortlessly across the stage during a performance of Billie Jean on the 1983 Motown 25 special, he left audiences speechless. The moonwalk became his signature, a symbol of his untouchable genius. Beyond the music, Michael had a heart for philanthropy. He was deeply affected by the suffering of others and used his influence to bring attention to global issues. In 1985, alongside Lionel Richie and a slew of superstar artists, he co-wrote and performed We Are the World, a charity single aimed at raising funds to help famine relief in Africa. The song became a massive hit, raising over $63 million. But as his fame grew, so did the pressures of being in the public eye. The tabloids were relentless, and rumors about Michael's personal life began to circulate. His appearance changed dramatically over the years skin lightening due to vitiligo, multiple plastic surgeries, and his reclusive nature led to widespread speculation. Michael's eccentricities, from his pet chimpanzee bubbles to his grand Neverland ranch, made him both a subject of fascination and criticism. Despite the media's obsession with his personal life, Michael's music continued to captivate millions. Albums like Dangerous and History kept his legacy alive through the 90s, producing hits like Black or White, and you are not alone. His message was often one of unity and peace, but the constant scrutiny began to take its toll. In 1993, the first allegations of child molestation were made against Michael. It was a turning point in his career and personal life. Though he denied the accusations and settled out of court, his image was irreparably damaged. More allegations followed in 2003, resulting in a highly publicized trial in 2005. This time, he was acquitted of all charges, but the emotional and financial toll was immense. Through it all, Michael never stopped creating. He never stopped believing in his art. In 2009, he announced This Is It, a series of 50 sold-out concerts in London. It was meant to be his grand comeback, 
a chance to remind the world of the artist he always had been. But tragically, it was not to be. On June 25, 2009, the world was shocked to hear of Michael Jackson's sudden death at the age of 50 due to acute propofol intoxication. The news spread like wildfire, and millions around the globe mourned the loss of a legend. Candlelight vigils, public memorials, and tributes poured in from all corners of the world. His death left a void that can never be filled, but his music, his influence, and his artistry remain immortal. Even after his death, Michael Jackson's influence on music, fashion, and culture remains undeniable. From Beyonce to Justin Timberlake, from hip-hop to K-pop, his DNA runs through the fabric of modern entertainment. His innovative approach to music videos, his blending of genres, his philanthropy, all of it continues to inspire new generations of artists and fans. Michael Jackson was more than just an artist. He was a phenomenon, a force of nature whose music united people across the world. Despite the controversies and tragedies that marred his later years, his contributions to music and culture are irrefutable. He made us feel, he made us dance, and he made us believe in the power of art to change the world. The King of Pop may be gone, but his legacy will continue to moonwalk through time. Michael Jackson's voice and vision continue to inspire, reminding us of the power of music to heal, to unite, and to transform. For new generations of fans and artists, his body of work stands as a timeless reference, a treasure trove of artistry that shaped the sound of modern music. As we remember his legacy, we invite you to revisit the music, performances, and albums that turned him into the king of pop. Here are some of Michael Jackson's iconic albums and unforgettable stage performances that have left an indelible mark on music history. Studio albums Off the Wall, 1979, featuring classics like Don't Stop Till You Get Enough and Rock With You, Off the Wall was the start of Michael's groundbreaking solo career. Thriller, 1982, the best-selling album of all time with unforgettable tracks such as Billie Jean, Beat It, and Thriller. Bad, 1987. Marked by hits like Bad, Smooth Criminal, and Man in the Mirror, this album solidified his global superstar status. Dangerous, 1991. Songs like Black or White and Remember the Time introduced a new era of socially conscious music. History, Past, Present, and Future, Book 1, 1995, a combination of greatest hits and new material, including Scream and You Are Not Alone, capturing the complexities of Michael's later years. Invincible, 2001, his final studio album, featuring the hits You Rock My World and Butterflies, showing his evolving sound. Notable stage performances and tours. Motown 25, Yesterday, Today, Forever, 1983. Michael's performance of Billie Jean at this special event introduced the world to the moonwalk, a moment that would become a cultural phenomenon. Victory Tour, 1984. The last tour with his brothers as part of the Jacksons, featuring hits from the Jackson 5 era as well as his early solo material. Bad World Tour, 1987-1989. Michael's first solo tour which broke records across the globe, featuring groundbreaking choreography and live renditions of his Bad Album hits. Dangerous World Tour, 1992 to 1993, a tour that not only showcased Michael's musical prowess, but also his message of unity, love, and humanitarian efforts, reaching millions worldwide. History World Tour, 1996 to 1997, his third and final world tour, an extravaganza of music and theatrical performance with a powerful social message. This is it, planned 2009 the highly anticipated comeback that was never fully realized. This Is It promised to be Michael's greatest live performance series. Although it never came to fruition, it gave the world one last glimpse of his creative genius. For today's artists, Michael Jackson remains a masterclass in innovation. His work not only shaped pop music but transcended it. As you explore his albums and legendary performances, you'll find that Michael's story is far from over. His influence continues to pulse through every beat and every lyric in the music of today. In every moonwalk, every melody, and every heartfelt performance, the king of pop lives on.